it's okay. <sighs> Welcome to my what's in my kit video. I recorded this video literally months ago. And I thought it would be funny to tell you what's still accurate and what's not. So let's get right into it. I got a lot of stuff when I started school and I want to show you what I got and I finally got it all. So we got an iPad on the second day of school um, and this is what we do all of our schoolwork on. Uh, we take pictures on rather than have our phones out, so we use our devices, whatever. Um, I have my book downloaded on there. I grabbed an Apple Pencil so I can take notes and everything like that. And it's honestly really great to just not have to carry around eight books because they're huge. I mean, the books are literally like, oh my god. Like, Anyways, I leave that in my locker. I don't take it anywhere. I don't even take it out because it's all on my lap or on my, my iPad, so I don't need it. Um, it's a generation eight. And I got a case from Target. It's green. It's really cute. It's not the best because it doesn't have an Apple Pencil holder, which I didn't really think about. But I needed one and so I just grabbed it. It's okay. There's a little slot. I jam it in there. My iPad case is annoying. It's starting to break the thing that I was shoving the pencil into. Actually, let me show you. Let me show you. Isn't it? It's literally right here. So like, here's the case. And like this little tab thing that this pencil's in, it's literally like a tab to flip the camera down. And I shove my pencil in it and it's like starting to come off. So I just ordered a new case on Amazon that actually has like a holder like on the side right here. It was only $10, so hopefully it's not like a cheapo case, but I don't really care. I mean, I literally have a hair color all over this. Actually, it's only that one spot, but it really bothers me. And I look at it every day. So I ordered a new one. <laughs> really doing good, really going strong. This is my purse, technically. I don't know, um, I got it from Old Navy. I love it. It's so cute, it's so easy to carry. It's got a little zipper on the top. You can see I can fit all of my stuff in there. Let's bring it out, okay. So first off, I have my lunchbox that I also got at Target and I think there's still food in here. Well, there's still an ice pack and a fork in there, so that's cool. I kind of hate this, but it does the job and it's small and that's what I wanted, so I don't really care. That lunchbox is still the bane of my existence. It like doesn't shut all the way and it just makes it really annoying, but I just put it in the fridge at school, so it still doesn't matter, but it's still the bane of my existence. Don't buy it. It was only $10 from Target, but it was, it's, it's junk. I also have a scheduling book in here that I got for school and then when I quit school I don't really use it anymore but I thought it might be nice to put appointments in eventually. I just threw that schedule book away. <laughs> and then I have a binder. I use this for application and I use my laptop more for actual learning if that makes sense. So when I'm like up and doing things like cutting hair or doing a chemical relaxer like I have the directions in here so I don't have to like touch an electronic with my gross hands or whatever. I've literally never used that binder. If I don't know how to do something, I just ask someone. So that's my bag. I thought this was the cutest thing. This bag opens on the top. It has two zippers that open up. And then there's a ton of stuff on the inside, which I will take out in a minute. But we mostly use the bottom of the bag. This little guy holds our shears. So we have two pairs of shears here. So these are our normal ones and then the um, texturizing shears. And then we've got our razor here, which we just learned how to use and it was actually really cool and really fun and I really like it, even though I was terrified of it at first. We have our two um, little brushes and some different kind of combs. I've been in school for six months and I haven't used the razor since we use them in basics. So this little guy unzips, has a little thing that opens up there. And it also Velcro, so this piece comes open. And then on the inside, quite a bit of stuff. So we have our little mixing bowl here, which we've already used once, which is kind of fun. We've got our nitrile gloves. We have our little uh, bottle guy here that we haven't used yet. Eight gazillion clips. This stuff is like really nice. No, it's not. <laughs> it's not at all. Pretty sure this is a little manicure set and we will learn soon. So we've got that guy. So that's pretty nice. And then we also have our clippers. So we've got all the guards on one side and then the actual clippers on the other. 
Yeah, I don't know how to use these. These terrify me. Fun fact, I'm not scared of them anymore. You're welcome. This is my backpack. For some reason, they make us lock it. I don't know why. I don't lock it. I haven't locked it in like months. I actually use the lock for the gym now, so it's not even, no. So this just opens up like this. So on the inside of this big boy, there is a lot, but not a lot. This holds all of our hot tools. So we've got, um, it's kind of nice, there are like thermal pockets on either side of this thing here. So there's one on this side right here, and there's one on this side over here. Okay, but the thermal pockets is actually really nice because I never wait for my curling iron to cool down. I just shove it in my bag. And that's probably so dangerous, but it's got a thermal pocket, so who cares? You know what I mean? Like, come on, it's genius. Like, everybody needs a book bag with a thermal pocket in it, okay? 100%, it's a necessity. So on this side, we have the iron. We have our straightener over here. Probably our most used item so far is this round brush. Yeah, we're besties. I hate that stupid brush. It's like melted now. We also have two more brushes in here, I think. I don't know what either of them are called. There's this guy, air can get through it, so we use it sometimes to blow dry. And um, here's the other one. And then our blow dryer. Uh, mine's, I got like a, I have a smaller one that I use personally, so this is really heavy. It makes my arm hurt, <laughs> but uh, it's okay. We have a diffuser and then two of these. One's bigger and then the other one's smaller. So this is a file and buffer pack. So we're gonna start nails the, the last week, fourth or fifth week of basics. I'm on the third starting this Wednesday. Um, actually no, by the time you see this, I'll be on Probably week three. I'll probably be finishing week three when you see this video. Uh, I never, I never finished this. So I'm like six months in now. <laughs> oh my god. Um, we have a facial brush from we do facials, and um, here's our pedicure kit. So we have to do that too. And then this guy is a little nail brush, and I'm assuming this is for when we do acrylics. This one in here just has uh, my mannequin um, stand extension pieces. So like this is an extension piece. There's one more. I don't know how they work. I've never used them. I'm sure they literally just like screw into each other. I still haven't used them and I still don't know how they work, but they're actually necessary and I don't know how to use them. Next, we have bobby pins and little hair ties, little hair elastics that we've used on our mannequins for updos, which I've also posted. Um, about on my Instagram, so if you haven't already followed that, you sh probably should. It's Mare Times Hair, Mare X Hair. I try to post on there every day, but I forgot. I typically forget on the days that I don't go to school because it's, it's I'm not like thinking about it. I work, so last pocket is this little back pocket here, and it holds a lot of, of stuff. This first guy is our makeup brush set. So, looks like this. I don't know how great the brushes are. I'm assuming they're all synthetic and they all have pink tips. So, I don't use brushes that look anything like this on myself, um, literally at all. Ooh, that's really rough. Yeah, okay. So this is gonna be a really fun one. The brushes suck, I hate them. Next. We have this guy. This is the case for our shears. It's empty right now because they're in the bag, but there's a little spray in there to keep them clean. Um, and this does hold both the texturizing and the regular shears. Really nice, really cool. And then I also have two capes in here, a blue and a black. And then this is our skincare booklet when we get there, which is week five. Yeah, that is it. Let me repack this bad boy. That is pretty much everything that came in my kit. 
Aside from that, we did get four mannequins with different hair colors, textures, and that's everything aside from the mannequin stand and then like, I think we got hand wipes. Really cool. All right, well, I think needless to say, a lot has changed since I filmed this video. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, but I just thought it'd be kind of fun and kind of funny because it's literally been like months. Like it is, like it is, I filmed this in February and it's July. So cute, really fun. Um, I'm not gonna say see you next week because I think I said that at the end of this video and that was so not true. So I'll see you next time. <laughs> I don't know when that's gonna be though. <laughs> Bye guys. <laughs>